Hello friends, I'm here with our 99 cent store haul and we're just going to get right into it. If I do get cut off, I will be back with part two. Right now I'm having problems with my camera. Okay, Crystal's Deals of the Week. We did pick up Apple Blossom by Yardley London. This is limited edition and it says with cinnamon leaf oil. And I did pick it up for only 49 cents and they did tape these. I guess someone tried to steal them, I'm not sure because this one I also picked up for 49 cents and this is the Dove Bar. And it is just, I guess, with almond, because that, yeah, a beauty bar. And yeah, I guess it has almond in it, but they were half off, because like I said, I guess someone opened these up or they, maybe they opened up on their own, I'm not sure. But anyways, Dove is a great brand and I did want to try that Apple Blossom anyways, so it was a deal. I also was able to find in the collection, the Queen collection, Cover Girl, and I am absolutely loving the pink one that I hauled last time, and this is actually from two hauls ago. I finally found it in my trunk, and um, I was looking for it everywhere because I absolutely love the pink one, so I'm super stoked that I found it, and this one is in, what does that say? All right, it's not telling me the name. Wait, I'll check up here. This is Lavender. I'm not sure why they're calling it Lavender, but it is really gorgeous. And like I said, these are my colors. This pink and this type of like metallic-y um, brown. Cannot wait to try it. And I'm so glad that I found it. So now I can finally use it. All right, we are gonna get straight into the haul. All right, it was not a big week at all for beverages. I'm not sure what's going on, but I did pick up Khalifa Farms unsweetened oat milk, and it says made from whole grains. This is no gums or stabilizers, nut-free, 48 fluid ounces. Um, shake while settling is natural, and the expiration date on this is December, I'm sorry, this looks like December 8th, 2019. So I'm going to give this one more try. And if I don't like this again, I'm just, I'm not going to haul it anymore because I have given this, I mean, they've been different ones, but this is this, this is like the fourth different brand I've tried. Well, not different brand, but I guess milk from Khalifa and I'm hoping it's good. I did just pick up one of the Tropicana Essentials and I picked it up because it said fiber and it said good source of fiber and it's apple cherry. It's just a quart, 140 calories, which is kind of a lot per eight ounces. December 4th, 2019 is the expiration date on that. And as you can see, it's a lot is settling on the bottom. So you definitely want to shake these, especially if you freeze them. I also grabbed some grapes. I absolutely love grapes. This is my second pack of the week not sure how much these were i think they're like a dollar 90 or 99 cents a pound yeah they're 99 cents a pound so i'm sure i paid like two or three dollars and then they also had the extra creamy ready whip and this is let's see this is the big one this is 13 ounces and i did check the expiration date and it's best by february 17th 2020 so not a lot came in through deli i didn't haul any meat i didn't haul any cheese but we did pick up a lot in the frozen section so we're gonna go over to the freezer now and i did haul these avocados because they brought them back down to a dollar 99 versus 2.49 and even at 2.99 so for a dollar 99 you are going to get about five avocados and i do try and choose the ones that are coming close to being ripe and um this feels like it is a nice bag and there's some nice size avocados. So yeah, I'm not gonna pay more than $1.99 for a little bag of avocados. These are new and these were a pleasant surprise. These are the original Boca Mexican style bowls, black beans, brown rice, vegetables and cheese and a Mexican style sauce. 12 grams of protein and only 280 calories. So I did pick up two for myself because I'm not sure if I'm going to like them, but I'm pretty sure I will. So I'm kind of, I should have probably picked up more because this is a great deal. Boca is an expensive brand and to be able to haul it for, at the 99 cent store for 99 cents is pretty awesome. And you know what? I cannot get an expiration date off of this. This is like too light. Um, it looks like Best Buy 
January 21st, 2020. Oh, okay. All right, and then I did pick up two of the Healthy Choice Power Bowls, and this is turkey, sausage, and egg white scramble. I don't know what I was thinking or why I only picked up two, because I usually haul, I don't know, six, eight of these, and I don't know what I was thinking. I think I thought these were the pesto bowls, and they're not. These are the actual good ones, which explains why there was... They totally sold out. So that was my loss. I only picked up two. Expiration date is best by January 11th, 2020. I also picked up another of the Turkey Veggie Panini by Smart Ones. Um, 5.9 ounces. And we do have an expiration date of March 14th, 2020. Since they are doing their deals of the day, um, this is Fast Fixins Chicken Breast Nuggets One made with 100% natural chicken breasts. So this is, this was, I think $2.99 or $3.99. And I think I, I paid $1.99. Yes, I'm pretty sure that was the sale or 99 cents. I'm so sorry. You know, I don't even remember. All I know is they brought it down enough for me to figure why not get these. Um, and this is the chicken breast nuggets, 100% natural chicken breasts. And it's all white meat chicken. And my husband did like the popcorn chicken, so I'm assuming he'll probably like this. This is a pound and a half, eight ounces. There's 30 or more crispy nuggets. And it says ready in minutes. So like I said, I mean, this has been at the 99 cent store forever. And I just never have hauled it because I'm too cheap. Expiration date is October 3rd, 2020. So that's a great expiration date. They also had TJF Friday Meatballs Marinara. And this is nine ounces. Now, I did grab four of these, and they are Angus beef. And we all know TGIF Fridays made with Angus beef, microwave ready, and yeah, pork, Angus beef, meatballs, and a marinara sauce topped with aged Parmesan cheese. So this can be with make, make meatball sandwiches, spaghetti and meatballs. You can do a lot with this, or you can eat it like I'm going to eat it, and I just eat the meatballs, which is why I did pick up four packages. And of course, these sold out really quick as well. Expiration date is January 11th, 2020. So now we're starting to get into January. That is pretty interesting. Um, Smart made Mexican style pulled pork bowl. And this is, I believe this is pretty much like Smart Ones. It's just a different brand called Smart made. Expiration date on this is August 21st, 2020. Loving these 2020 expiration dates. This is 10 ounces. And this is slow cooked pulled pork with black beans, roasted vegetables over brown rice, lightly tossed with a green chili lime sauce and topped with Monterey Jack cheese. Now this is 90, this was 99 cents. I think at one time they were trying to sell us for $1.99 and they did not move. I also did pick up some mashed potatoes because I am getting ready for um, Thanksgiving and I'm not going to be making my own mashed potatoes. So no artificial preservatives, excellent source of vitamin C. This is the Orida home style mashed potatoes and I forgot, did I freeze these? I don't know if you can, oh yeah, keep frozen. Okay, keep frozen, so I'm okay with that. All right, I thought I put these in the fridge. Um, used by February 2020, they'll be used for Thanksgiving. And last but definitely not least are these cute little Oscar Mayer um, Minion Mini Corn Dogs. I did get these for my husband. There's about 13 in each box. I thought he could just make these for a snack while he watches his football. Nine ounces a box. And we have an expiration date Oh, uh, let's see what this one says. Best by December 20th, 2019. So I did pick up more than usual when it comes to um, the frozen section. But like I said, it's just really, really slow when it came to deli. It has been a moment since I have really hauled any hostess. And I was lucky enough to run into some ho-hos at one of my go-to stores. Expiration date is November 29th, 2019, and you do get 10 individually wrapped cakes. I only picked up one because a lot of this stuff ends up being given away, and I'm kind of glad I have not been running into a lot of the hostess stuff. Um, I did pick up this Duncan Hines perfect size chocolate chip cookie cake. How cute is that? Made with real chocolate chunks, six inch pan, microwaves in about two minutes. Yummy, yummy for my tummy, but I cannot eat this. And I want to so badly, maybe on my cheat day. 6.6 .6 ounces. 
and we do have an expiration date of December 8th, 2019. So this is a really fun little dessert to warm up, have some hot chocolate or coffee and get all nice and cozy and watch your favorite Christmas movie. All right, we do have Food Network Kitchen Inspirations and this is Greek feta herb, 12 fluid ounces. Expiration date is December 9th, 2019. I need to start eating more vegetables and more salad. So I'm hoping by bringing in some of this awesome dressing, it'll get me to start eating more salad. All right, we have Bitten Creamy Strawberry made with real fruit dressing, 12 fluid ounces. I absolutely love the fact it's 50 calories for two tablespoons because that is pretty decent for dressing. And December 29th, 2019 is the expiration date on that. All right, I have been looking for these and finally I found them. Um, this is, let's see, Belvita Soft Filled Cocoa Cream. These look so yummy. So I did get two boxes. These are five 1.76 ounce individual packs in each box. November 24th, 2019 is the expiration date. And finally, I was able to haul these. I've, I've hauled the strawberry ones. I've just never been able to haul the chocolate ones. All right, this, these are too cute. And this is the Snack Sacks Reclosable um, Nabisco Barnum Animal Crackers. New look, same great taste, good source of calcium. And this is eight ounces. So expiration date is November 28th, 2019. All right, I also picked up the Minions and the Shopkins by Kellogg. Super cute. There's 10 pouches in every in each box and each one is eight ounces i believe yes eight ounces and let's get our expiration date our expiration date is november 25th 2019 for the minions and for the shopkins it is november 23rd 2019 and this stuff will be definitely will be donated and i was also able to haul some cool cereal all right it is that time again where we're gonna get the Kellogg's peeps from Easter, they do hit the 99 cent store. This is 10.5 ounces, 99 cents, not a bad deal. Expiration date is November 29th, 2019. So I do need to find a home for this cereal rather quickly. I also picked up Bare Naked Premium Granola, White Chocolate, white chocolate Macadamia Nut, Coconut Oil, Cashew Butter, Fair Trade White Chocolate, Pumpkin Seeds, and Macadamia Nuts. That sounds so good. 11 ounces. This would make an, like an awesome um, cookie. All right. Let's see what the expiration date is on this. And if I can't find it, I'm not going to trip. Oh, but here it is. Okay. Before December 8th, 2019. I have a feeling I'll have to find this one at home as well. Because my husband does not like macadamia nuts. So macadamia nuts. And I totally forgot about that. So that bare naked will be leaving us. Okay, I hauled these for 99 cents before they marked them up to $1.99. I have no idea why they're trying to sell these for $1.99. They're canalitas and they're cinnamon cookies. There's eight packs. I mean, there's nothing special about them, but the expiration date is September 30th, 2020. So I'm thinking that's why they're trying to sell these for $1.99. It was a pound, a pound and 0.96 ounces. But I'm just letting you know, you might see these for $1.99 or you might see them for $0.99. Cents. I hauled them for $0.99. Cents. And when I walked into a couple of $0.99 cent stores, I couldn't believe that they were pricing them at $1.99. All right. This wasn't a huge food haul because I can't haul what's not there. Um, I don't know what's going on with Orange County, but we're just, we're not getting a lot of food at all. It's just been pretty much the same stuff every single shipment. And the only thing that really came through new was a lot of the frozen stuff, which that was what I hauled. The majority of the food haul was. But all in all, this is still a good haul because this is an all name brand haul. And that is the name of the game. All right. Now we're going to get into my favorite part. I fell in love with these and these sold out really quickly. They are $1.99, which is kind of pricey. They're only 20 pieces. But I definitely want to put this on my little mini flocked tree that I did get from Dollar Tree. So I figured 40 of these would look absolutely adorable. And I'm going to do a red and white little tree. 
Um, as you all know, they sell those little trees at the Dollar Tree for a dollar. And I did pick up a white one, a brand new white one, and I'm going to be doing it red and white. So I thought these would look really super cute on them. And yay, everyone, I was finally able to get my um, tablecloth on and my table mats. And I'm starting to get my my table ready for Thanksgiving. So super happy about that. All right. I finally did complete. I think last week I started showing you this and I said that I was missing the barn, the barn, the farm, the barn, and I completed my set. So now I have all three super excited. Not sure if I'm going to put them on the tree if they're, or if they're going to be used as table decor, but I absolutely love it. And I love this barn with the Christmas trees and the whole snowy look. And this is actually glass. So that is really cool as well. All right, in keeping with Christmas, I am also going to complete my collection of these signs. And this one says, have a holly jolly Christmas. I did haul the other two designs and this one will absolutely complete it. 99 cents and I love how it sits like a picture. I already know where this is going to go. It is too cute. All right, I fell in love with these and this is mistletoe for sale. Kisses are free, 25 cents. Again, I'm not sure if I'm going to be hanging this up or if it's going to be going on the tree because this is definitely would look nice on my tree as well. And they also had it in a couple of different designs, which I'll show you right now. And here are the candy cane signs. So I did get two of the candy cane. And again, when they put these boxes out, these went really quick as well. I didn't even know there was a mistletoe one. And I ran into it at another store and there was only one. So I have one mistletoe and two of the candy cane signs. I really like the candy cane applique, as you can see. And I just think it is really cute. And I love just how vintagey it looks. And this is actually... I think would look really good on my big tree. And for 99 cents, I really thought this was cute. Um, you know, you all know how I am loving the snowman. It's just really plain. But again, this is going to go really good on my big tree. So I did pick up one in the snowman, one with the reindeer loving his little red scarf. And I actually picked up two in the reindeer. These say Mar those say Merry Christmas. Yeah, all three of them do say Merry Christmas. And these went super quick. How cute are, is this? It says, I wish you a Merry Christmas. And that is absolutely adorable. I love it. What I really like is the tie. I absolutely love how they use the twine and you have the berry and you have the little faux pine cones. And yeah, I mean, it's just too cute. And like I said, I was really surprised that they were selling this for only 99 cents. So I did pick it up in with the reindeer. And how cool is this Santa Claus? He is just too cute. And he also comes with this decor, loving it. And I just love how vintagey. I mean, this looks like a 1950s Santa Claus. So these are definitely going to be going, I don't, I don't know where they're going to go, but I had to have them because that definitely goes with my motif as well. Sticking with my motif, I found these. Now I did haul Joy and I think the other one said Noel, but I did not see these mooses or reindeer rather until this week. So I did pick up two more and I cannot wait to put those on our big tree. There's just so much cute stuff. All right, these wooden snowflakes are $1.49, but I absolutely fell in love with them. So I did pick up four and I do like how they're long because that will give me, I mean, they're, they're really big and that's another great thing. So these will look really nice on the tree as well. And I do, I thought I got four. Oh yes, I did get four. All right, here we go. I did pick up four and each one's $1.50. So some of them are different. This one is a solid one. This one has a star in the middle. These two have a star in the middle. So I have two solid ones and two, two with the stars in the middle. I didn't even notice that. So that is pretty cool as well. How cute is this? The little beanies. I just thought these were adorable. They also come in the red and white. 
And here are the two adorable little sweaters. I think they are so cute. And I'm thinking about putting these on my white little tree from the Dollar Tree. Like I said, I wanna do it in red and white and that would look really cute with the candy canes and maybe these as well. And I also do have the red and white other um, little sweaters. I just, of course, can I find them? No, because we're shooting. All right, straying a little bit away from um, Christmas, I did pick up this black and blinged up bow that covers your ears. It is a headband, one size fits most for $1.99. Again, this is another cute idea for a stocking stuffer or if you're exchanging like Christmas presents or doing Secret Santa Claus and you have a budget, um, this is another little cute item that you can stick like in a little Christmas basket. I mean, it is adorable and it does come in different colors, but you all know that I love black and of course I love the bling, so I had to get it in this shade. All right, going back into Christmas. Oops, sorry. Hold on. And how cute is this little owl? And look at him. He's just too fun. So I did pick him up. And I think there's one with the red and white buffalo check, but I don't know if I picked if I got him because just I picked up a bunch of ornaments this week. And I'm just kind of grabbing them as we go, but definitely loved him. And Look at this Santa Claus. He is too cute with his red and black buffalo check. So I think you guys can tell what type of motif I'm going for with my big tree. And I had to get the snowman. I thought he was too cute as well. Loving his scarf. I love his hat. And it just looks like he'll be a lot of fun as well. All right, more Santa Claus. I know I am like going Santa Claus crazy this Christmas. All right, this one has the little plaid hat, and these were 99 cents. He has the little navy blue with snowflakes hat. And I believe I did get one more. Yes, I did. These are all three. And this is what they look like. So these are all three with their different hats, and I just wanted all three because I thought they would look really nice on our big tree. I also picked up one of each of the bows. As you can see, one is red and white, one is black and white. Again, I might be using this as a topper for the little white tree because I definitely am going to be doing it red and white. And I don't know what I'm going to do with this one yet, but I thought it'd be cool to have both of them on hand because these make actually good toppers for those small trees. So maybe this one will go on the green tree from the Dollar Tree. Not sure yet. And... I found more of the red truck. These are only 99 cents, so I did pick up two more. And I also decided to get one in blue as well, 99 cents. And I did pick up a second snowman. I found him while I was going through the rest of our ornaments. All right. And for my Candyland theme, I had to have these two. How cute are they? I just was like, oh, I wish they had them. I did not find the larger ones. I don't even know if these come in or, or come in a larger size. I'm just saying that this is going to go really cute with my whole Candyland theme. So, of course, I had to pick it up. And Merry Christmas. I absolutely love this plate. It was or it is a dollar for 49 on our Instagram. There is two more design. Well, not two more designs, just two more saints. I think one is believe and one is happy holidays. They only had one of the Merry Christmas plates. Of course, these are selling out the quickest. And I mean, for a dollar 49, you cannot beat the price. Super cute. And I do like the nutcracker. So I did get two in red. I might go and get two in blue. I'm not sure. Again, I do need to pull out my Christmas decor decorations. I was watching our videos last year and I hauled a lot of Christmas decorations last year. So I know I have a lot of stuff, but it is what it is. Okay. And I love this hat. I, it took me a while to decide if I wanted it or not because it's two forty nine. but you know what? It is leopard and I just think it's really cute. I love the big furry faux pom-pom on top. And again, it makes for a really cute gift or a stocking stuffer. 
Okay, I also picked up these new underwear and they're hipsters, three pairs for $2.99. So that works out to 99 cents a pair. I did get a size seven. I do like my underwear nice and comfy. This is Sport Comfort X Temperature, designed to adapt to temperature for all day comfort. So we'll see if I like them. I'm sure I'll, I won't have a problem with them. All right, I also did pick up this one lip smacker. I could not, I, I found the whole frozen ones and I just was like, which one do I get? Because I know I don't need any more. So I did pick up Olaf and he's a cutie pie. I also did pick up the three minute miracle color and perm lasting care. As you all know, I do dye my hair blonde. So I do like the three minute miracle by Pantene and this was only 99 cents. So you cannot beat the price. Usually they're a dollar 99 by smoke and mirrors. They did come out with these new nudes and I really liked the glitter. And I also liked the cupcake, which is this color right there. I thought I could have some fun. And again, if you have friends that love makeup like I do, teenage daughters or friends, cousins, I mean, anyone that likes makeup at any age, there, this is sold at the 99 cent store. It's cute packaging and I do use smoke and mirrors. I use, I use it on my eyes and I can vouch for it. It, it does a pretty good job. Does it do a Mac job or, you know, department store name brand job? It comes pretty close. It comes pretty close. So there was different shades. They're on our Instagram, but I wanted this because like I said, I love the cupcake and I love that glitter right there. Okay, these are back and I'm super glad because I've been looking all over to see if they have the St. Ives Acne Control. Um, I actually prefer the Blackhead one, but for $2.99, it's a lot cheaper than buying it at Walmart. So I did pick up the, the Apricot Scrub because I'm almost out of the Blackhead Scrub. So this came out just in time. I also picked up two of these flocking um, snow spray snows because we are going to be spraying spray snows snow spray because we are going to be flocking our tree and we're just going to use two because we don't want a heavily flocked tree. We just want a light one. All right. This is from Kmart and these sell for like five something. They're $2.99 at um, the 99 cent store. This has a really strong scent. I absolutely love the picture holiday candle collection winter wreath this is an 18 ounce it's only a one wick but it is strong this is definitely going to be a strong scent and i mean when you open it up it's like wow it is very piney smelling but it's also i just absolutely love the sticker on it and this little jar for 99 cents is really cute and an adorable addition to a coffee bar or to a hot chocolate bar. Fill him up with hot cocoa or marshmallows or candy canes. But he is too cute and he was 99 cents. He does remind me of Olaf. So I did pick him up as well. And these are back. We have Squishable Squeeze Me Slow Rise Little Mini. And it's a sque squishy clip-on. How cute is that? And I was able to find the last mini, which I was so excited because these clip on and you can put these like when we go to Disneyland um, on Valentine's Day every single year. And so I will be putting these on my backpack. And like I said, I did find Mickey as well. And there you can see the little clip on. So I will be clipping Mickey and Minnie on my backpack or my purse and super cute. So I will be storing those away. And I also picked up the Tsum Tsums for $3.99 because they have Jack. Yep, I love Jack. They have the Fairy Godmother, they have Eeyore, they have Captain Hook, and they have Bambi. And this was just too much of a good um, selection. I'm not sure what the mystery one is, but I'm, I don't, really don't want to open it. At least, yeah, I don't think I want to open it. All right, I am so happy. I found this again. These have been selling like crazy. I bypassed it twice. And then when I finally decided that I wanted it, they were gone. Now you do have a choice of the red ribbon or the blue ribbon and they have a different pattern. I chose the blue because I really love the Buffalo check and the other one with the red ribbon, which I thought I wanted did not have Buffalo check. It just kind of had a plain, it was just a lot more plain, but I love this for $1.99.
too, too cute. Merry Christmas, Lake Tahoe, 200 miles. Merry Christmas, let it snow. Super, super cute. And sticking with smoke and mirrors and makeup, I definitely wanted to make sure that I did have the right jet black felt tip eyeliner. So I just went ahead and bought this one because I absolutely love it. It just has different packaging. And then I also picked up the liquid eyeliner again. How awesome are these gifts? These are $2. You could make a beauty bag for under $10 easily. Okay, I did pick up this Merry Christmas with the truck, of course. It is not the red truck, but it is the blue truck, and I thought it was too cute. This is actually a placemat. I'm actually going to be using it for something different. Um, like I said, I have, I'm going to be decorating one, two, I'm going to be decorating four trees this year. Um, one that I showed you last year, I mean, I'm sorry, last week with the little light, it's like about two feet tall with the pre-lights from the 99 and then two from the Dollar Tree, the white one and the green one. So I'm actually going to be using this as a tree skirt for one of them. And I thought that that would just look really, really cute. So I only needed one and 99 cents. Now they've never had these before at the 99. These are actually napkins. You get two for $1.99, so it averages out to 99 cents. So I did pick up um, two packs, so I do have four napkins. I'm not sure what my tablecloth is gonna look like, but I figured I could not go wrong with red and white, and I really do like this. Okay, I also picked up another dish towel. I did haul two of these last week. I'm sorry, one of these last week, and I decided I wanted a set. And this is also, wait, hold on. And this is another placemat, which will be a, a, it will be another tree skirt for one of my mini trees. I absolutely thought it would go really well with probably the green tree. So this will be my green tree skirt, the mini trees. And this is a towel, but again, I'm going to be using it as another tree skirt for another one of the small trees. So... And like I said, um, this is the first time the 99 has had these napkins, which I think is really cool. But I also picked up two of their towels because I'm not sure which ones I want to use as tree skirts yet. So I just want to make sure I have all my options open. And for 99 cents, you can't go wrong. And how cute is this rug for $2.99? You have the old fashioned Santa Claus. I absolutely love it. I want to pick up more. These are selling out really quick. If you like them, make sure you get them when you see them. I'm going to try and find more because I want more of these. He is too cute. And ta-da, this is going to go in my master bathroom. I already put up our shower curtain, which is the red truck, and it even has the matching hooks. So how excited was I to be able to find this at the 99 cent store? It's going to make my, my bathroom perfect. Plus I have the red truck soap dispenser. So this is absolutely clinches it. Super excited. I am on the hunt for another one. So on a serious note, if you do like any of these prints or any of the prints that I've shown on our Instagram, and I did show all the prints, I am kicking myself for not hauling every single print. Um, I'm going to be, like I said, I'm going to look for these everywhere and I'm going to be hauling more of these. All right, my friends, we did it. We got through the haul. Yay. And my camera did not cut me off. All right. As always, we, we are the go-to channel for your 99 cent store hauls and we do show everything that does come through.